Hello, my dear students. For today's lesson, we will discuss elements and compounds. Do you know the difference between these two? Then, focus on this lesson to know more about elements and compounds. We already know that matter may be classified as substances or mixtures. Substances may be elements or compounds. Take note, elements are the simplest kind of matter, consists of only one kind of atom. They can be represented by a chemical symbol. They cannot be broken down into simpler form of matter by either physical or chemical means. While compounds are considered as pure substances like elements, they consist of two or more kinds of atoms. Compounds can be represented by a chemical formula and can be broken down into simpler form of matter by chemical means. Hmm, let us have a simple game. Identify whether the following substances are elements or compounds. Let's start with iron. Is it an element or a compound? That's right! It's an element! How about salt? Is it an element or a compound? You're all correct! There are 118 named and identified elements. 92 of them are naturally occurring and only a small percentage are artificially prepared in laboratories with the use of new technology. A periodic table of elements is an order table based on their increasing atomic numbers from left to right in periods and in groups for having similar chemical properties. So, where do these elements get their names? The International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry is an international organization of scientists that decides on the naming of elements and assigning their chemical symbols. Some elements are named after the people who discovered them. Some were derived from minerals. Others are named after the places where they are discovered. Other names of the elements are derived from their properties and from mythological character or astronomical object. We must remember that the initial letter of the common or Latin name of an element should be written in its capitalized form. If the chemical symbol consists of two letters, only the first letter is capitalized. Then, how do we write the symbols of these elements? Exactly! And those elements with Latin names should be written like this, okay? That's all for now. I hope you learned something today.